Hey everybody, so this is a uh, little video just to um, determine what our character is going to be in Skyrim, because that uh, Let's Play is coming up soon, and well, we kind of need uh, somebody to play as. So I have a couple of uh, suggestions from the Patreon, um, and I wanted to put them forward. So the very first one is one that I have been playing around with in my head, and also works well with what one of the patrons said. They wanted a spell sword of some sort. I would was thinking about playing a... Oh, Jesus, it's going to take forever. Oh, there we go. A high elf. Um, I don't know what I would make the face or anything like that just yet. And uh, not just any high elf, a Thalmor agent who was at the wrong place at the wrong time, was following Ulfric Stormcloak as a spy, and we just so happened to get caught. And maybe, you know, through all of this, we become Dovahkin. Maybe our uh, eyes... We, we set our sights to something a little grander than whatever the um, uh, Dominion could give us. So we would be playing a high elf. Um, we would be using short swords mostly, you know, short uh, blades and destruction magic uh, for the most part. Because uh, that's what the Thalmor use. We, it's a combination of stealth and magic and, you know, a little bit of... Uh, sword play in there uh for personality a total dick bag the thalmor agents are just terrible people and we should you know play into that and as far as where we go for the politics side of things imperials if you don't know what that means i mean we'll get into the game and get to that point but if you do know what it means it makes sense for a thalmor agent to be vying for the imperials to win for various reasons which we'll get into through the story if you like this idea go ahead and like vote for it in the comments or something you know Say yay, nay, if you want to change some things in the idea. I will listen to you guys. I wanted to give the patrons, you know, the first shot at uh, putting some things together. And um, we'll get into a couple of other things later. Next up. Ah, uh, the good old Argonian. What we played in Oblivion. Well, this one's going to be a little different, actually. Mainly in that the suggested... Um, Argonian uh, to play. This was submitted by Clint. Um, it's very much like what we did in Oblivion, where it's mostly uh, physical based. So I want to make a distinction between that and our last playthrough and the Thalmor agent, because the Thalmor agent, again, is using swords. I feel like if we go Argonian, break the mold completely, and we are going to go full, like, heavy melee i'm talking hammers maces all the stuff that you really don't usually use because it's a little too slow but we'll totally use it and just beat the shit out of everybody um they so yeah i think that especially because stealth is again more thou more agent and i want to differentiate these choices a, a good bit so we have like our stealth spy this will be our barbarian type character um the personality they suggested is neutral, but empathetic to be trodden characters and other Argonians. I can roll with that, you know, sort of like this heart of gold, but mostly you don't care too much about other people. Um, they have an, an idea of like a couple of backstories for it so that I can like play up because I will play the character how they're supposed to be. Um, either like an ex-slave or a guerrilla fighter or assassin or thief. I think we should go with either guerrilla fighter slash merc or an ex-slave because that fits with like why were we in the middle of Skyrim? Maybe we actually escaped. Um, and then politics, uh, they recommend Imperials because uh, storm cloaks are oppressive to Argonians and pretty much every other person. I think that that's a great idea, even though the Imperials don't really care too much about other people. I feel like Argonians would indeed go for Imperials more than anything else. So there's that idea. And there's one more idea, which I really actually kind of love, even though it's a joke. A Khajiit, but not just any Khajiit. <laughs> this Khajiit is Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> He's a Khajiit. He's uh, colored black and red. This is about as good as I can make it with the black and red. I'm sure I can play around with it a little bit more, but I wanted to make this quickly. Um, arranged play style, um, and it's a hit and run play style so you know get right in their face and shoot them up i think i would even go so far as to install a mod that lets me use uh two uh one-handed crossbows and go in you know like i have two pistols um personality ambivalent to good and evil because you do 
we have to be really in the middle of everything and not give a crap about anyone or anything. Because all we care about is ourselves. And uh, politics, flip a coin. If you don't get it, this is this is supposed to be Shadow the Hedgehog. And while it is a joke, mainly in suggestion, it's also super interesting because I've never done this sort of play style where you do a up-in-your-face, like, uh, ranged playstyle. I've always done stealth and everything, and I can incorporate some stealth into this as well, but I really am kind of digging the idea of just, like, running in and overpowering people with arrows. Um, I've never played something like that, and it would get me to play a Khajiit again, because I haven't played them in, like, forever. But those are the three uh, big suggestions that I have. I have smaller ideas um, that, you know, if none of these things are what you guys are into. I can always look somewhere else. Um, <laughs> but yeah, th these, these are the three ideas so far. If we do roll an Argonian, you know, I can even put in the fuck you hammer again, because that's becoming actually quite fun to reintroduce every now and then. Um, but let me know what you think. If you have newer ideas, go ahead and, you know, put them into the comments. I can't promise that they'll be the ones that I've picked because I kind of really like a couple of the Patreon ones. And if not, I will be forced to just pick one myself. Um, but hopefully you guys have some idea of what you want me to play. So thank you for watching again, leave comments and everything. And, um, we'll get to Skyrim hopefully soon. Bye-bye.